don't stop. Three Man months. is facing murder charges after fatally shooting a home intruder, Milton Lawyer says. 22 year old man is facing a murder charge after allegedly shooting a group of people who broke into his Milton home over the weekend. Police say a group of suspects entered the home with an intent to commit a arm, uh, commit a robbery when they were confronted by a man. Yo. This is be okay. I'm already pausing off the rip, but I really got to know how do y'all, how do cops or whoever be knowing like this is going to be only there to commit a home wreck? Like, yeah, they may, they may have walked in there with the mindset, like, yeah, we're going to go in here and just survive. But what if, like, what if they just be like, what if some one of the somebody out of the group or one of them just be like, have a change of heart and just be like, you know, I'm here to kill everybody in the crib. Like, I don't, like, the, the, the intentions may have been that, but, bro, anything could happen, bro. What if somebody see their face now? Is it, now they going, like, you feel me? Like, I just don't, it just don't make sense to me. Like, somebody come in my crib, I'm automatically assuming that they're here to kill me. Like, why would I think, like, oh, you're here to steal and do, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm thinking you in here to do, like, cause me some kind of bodily harm. Being robbed is not the first thing to come to my mind. It's, first of all, you're in my house without my permission. You came here to kill me. Like, I feel like that's any natural, like, maybe I'm bugging. Man, before a number of shots were fired. The criminal lawyer, Jag Verg, argues his client should not be charged with murder, for shooting at an intruder that no, broke into his home and attacked his mother. He is a registered firearm owner, so it is mm-hmm. legal. And, and this is another thing, bro. Depending on the state, bro. Like, you know, let's say for a state in New Jersey, like, I think they just made it open to carry. Like, before it used to be, like, used to have to, uh... If you were able to, like, other people that were, had, like, open to carry were, like, ex-military, ex-cops, you know, stuff like that. If you were a civilian and you wanted a gun in, in the state of New Jersey... It's not. It's it's a strict gun laws. Maybe not as super strict as New York, but very close because we're close in proximity. If I'm not mistaken, it could have changed. Or it is a self defense law in Jersey, but it's so like watered down, bro. It just makes no sense. Like even like getting a gun, like you have to have you. You can be a registered uh gun owner, but it has to be in your crib at all times. For example, somebody with the with the self defense law, if somebody breaks in your crib, let's say somebody breaks in your crib and you live in the state of New Jersey. If you're in your living room, you have to go to your, your bedroom or wherever, lock the door, and then if they break into that room, then I think even then you still can't kill them. It's no shoot to kill, which is kinda a slippery slope. You have to give them like a warning shot or something. You know what I'm saying? And you still have to be able, afterwards, you still have to prove that they had the intent to kill you, which is crazy. Because, again, if I am if I go from my living room all the way to my room and you still follow me, I'm, again, you break into my front door. I just automatically assume, bro, if you're not the cops, you're here to kill me. Like, it just, I don't know. Because why the hell are you here? Like, I don't got nothing for you. Like, besides my life. You know what I'm saying? He used his gun legally against the armed intruder. His intention was not to kill the intruder, only to shoot at him once. Now. Yeah, see, and that's what they, that's probably what they're going to try to get him with, him try to hang him with, because you, they want you to aim low, like, lower body, like, body, um, you know, it, like a leg, not a main artery or something, but again, bro, again, bro, these are intense situations, bro, just the same way cops be like, fear for my life, and all this, and they kill people and walk away scot-free, I just, it's just, ah, 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 now, whatever. It's not, it's not legal. You can't do that. Harm owners or not, you, you can have the, the gun. The gun's intent is not to protect yourself. Here. If you have a gun, let's say you have a handheld, like a, a, a rifle. Not a rifle, I'm sorry. If you have a handgun, okay? Uh, in your house, it is not made to protect yourself. Only to go to the gun range. Only to go to the gun range. Okay? See, the law this. tells you I was that about you, to say, this is why it's very important to know your laws, man. Different countries, different states operate with different sets of rules. So it's very important. Like, your state might be like, oh, somebody is on your lawn, you can kill them. My state might say, in no capacity are you able to kill somebody. You're able to give warning shots, but nothing, everything uh, non-deadly. You know what I'm saying? So or you're not able to use excessive force. It just all depends, man. You have to store your gun know your laws. in one safe. The bullets in the charge, the bullets has to be in a separate, separate yeah. locked compartment. 
and not in its charger, okay? So for you, let's say you have an intruder, you have to open one safe, you have to open the other safe, put the bullets in the charger, then proceed to whatever you got to do. But it's not, you cannot do that. You can't. It's not meant to defend yourself. Absolutely not. So, yeah, even though he is a gun owner. That's not what it says, though. It says self-defense with a firearm is legal as long as you can prove that your life was in danger through case law shows that can be difficult to prove. But it's, 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 that case is written, that is written, but the way they write it and they do it, it's likely that you're still going to be charged for murder. Yes. Positive. Like, it's, 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 yes, it's, it's, it's very likely, it's, it's very likely that you're going to be charged for murder. No, no, murder. if you, but the, 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 the things that you have, the boxes that you have to check for that to apply to Plus, you yeah, and yeah. go scots free, they, you're gonna get you're gonna get some time. Yeah, probably. You're gonna get some time. It, it's, 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 so here are the criteria. The criteria are the probabilities that you believed on reasonable grounds that a force or threat of force was being used against them or another person, aka mm-hmm. his mom. Yeah. You acted for the purpose of defending yourself or others from that use of force or threat of force. Your act perpetually committed in self-defense was reasonable in the circumstance, which basically means you didn't just run after them as they left the house and kept shooting them in the yeah, back. And that's another yeah. thing. Might be. No. If apparently, too, in some in some states, or at least in most states, if, if like, the attacker turns his back and you shoot him, that's murder. You're going to jail. Like, it's stuff like that, bro. But even if they are still in the house. Or if they surrender. You, if they're in the house. And they surrender, yeah. You're not allowed to kill them either. Oh, hey. I was just Man, going for a drive. I don't. Which is wild, yeah, because brother. up in... And they go for your mom, and you come with your gun, and they turn back, and you shoot him in the back. Yeah. You're done. Yeah. You're done. Okay. 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 You're done. You're done. So you, it's so, yeah, it's so and all yeah. these things happen in a split second, yeah, right? Yeah. So just the fact that he's like, oh shit, no, and you turn yeah. back, you're, you're done. Afraid. You saw someone, your mom's e- hurt. Exactly. You don't know if and they he was even, something, exact, weapon. Yeah. exactly. So yeah. even, ball, or, yeah. or, or he was, he was doing like. Know he, your laws, bro. This, they, 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 they spit in facts, bro. This junk is, is, it can get very treacherous. It can get, it's a slippery slope, man. It's a very slippery slope. And again, in, in, in any natural human's, human being's mind, once somebody reaches that threshold, your initial thought is not think. You're not thinking these checkoff lists. You're thinking to 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 get to 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 get out of that situation with whoever you're there with alive. You're not thinking. Oh, I gotta make sure he doesn't turn his back before I shoot. I gotta make sure I shoot at his legs. I gotta make sure I run to this room. I gotta make sure I go do this, that, and that. He's just not doing that. You feel me? Like regular human beings is just thinking like this person breached my safe, my my where where I'm safest at, and they're trying to do cause harm, bodily harm to me and whoever else is in this place, and you defend yourself. But you know, he was on the perpetrator was on the mom, and there's another one. He tried to shoot, and another perpetrator comes between them. You're done. So it's so messed up. I agree. That it's like you have to, yeah. it's like peep game. As a civilian, you have to exactly know how to act under pressure, which the police don't do they not. They don't do they don't exactly, bro. The police don't even move like that. And they are supposedly some of the most trained people, which they train is not hairstylists and people of that sort have more training in their field than police officers. Conversation for another day. But these are people who are supposed to be protecting, uh, preserving, you feel me, uh, uh, civilians. And they're doing even a poor job. So, and, But they're, again, they're walking off scot-free. And, and it's crazy. It's really crazy because a civilian who may be trained to a certain degree, or, or like, again, cops, cops are still human beings. They make mistakes. I get that. But they're killing people. In some of the most obscured and in, 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 in voice of reasoning and getting off on technicalities or whatever, and something like that happens where you don't have a, you can't really make a decision based off of oh I could call a cop or do something like you have to act, and and it's like you said a split second and it just take one second and it's something to go wrong you feel me and you would still be charged with murder whole time though if the person never broke in this this would just have never happened again in court. Doing, even though you may be doing something right in a court of law, they don't see it like that. It's it's not as simple as right or wrong. It's as simple as did they do? Is a check off? Did they do this? Is that and that and that in order for us not to charge them with this? Have 
They don't. That's they're not dope. held to that standard. Okay, I'll say this, and That's I'll make dope. it super easy for everyone watching, just from my perspective. Go I think this: if you break into someone's house, your life is forfeit. I don't yes. care if they shoot. Yes, I agree. I wholeheartedly shoot agree. In the back, I don't care if they shoot you in the head. I don't give up. Fuck. Straight up. If you break into their home and you start attacking, Straight they up. should kill you Straight and kill you everybody break into else the house. involved. Why, but what if they surrender? They better surrender and get on their knees and floor and put their hands out. That not maybe. But if you run it out, I don't know if you grab another weapon. I don't know what the fuck you're going to do. I'm not thinking. I'm blasting. That's what I would like to be able to say. Not kid and apparently. So, you know. There you go. No, not here. But. <clears throat> not here. I feel like that's how it should be. I, I feel like that's how. You, if you are such a fucking garbage piece of shit. That you do armed home invasions and you attack people, they should kill you. You are a fucking scum ass person who not only attacks people in their own homes, makes that place forever unsafe to them. Because yes. who wants to go back to a place where they were fucking attacked? I was about to say that's a, that's another side of it. Like afterwards, they the the ramifications in the in the rehabilitation afterwards, bro. You don't feel safe no more. Who who is this person that broke in here and did X, Y, and Z? I may or may not know them. They may or may not get caught. They can come back. You feel me? It's PTSD in that whole situation. Like, when you go home, now every time you look around, you're looking over your shoulder and all this in a panicky state. Bro, nobody wants to live like that, bro. I live here. Like, at the end of the day, out the outside world, I expect that to be dangerous. You get me? I come in this crib. I come in the house. I don't expect me to have to worry about somebody breaking in here again or something. Nobody wants... That's not a, 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 a way most human beings want to live. Okay? Bro. That's one of the most incredibly scary things that you yes. can go through when someone attacks your mom. In your like house. Like, how f***ing right paranoid you, you become after that fact? In your house. In your house. We ask like, you shit. destroy so much more. I don't give a shit what happens to that person. Throw them in the gallows, lights, I don't care. Oh, I have a, you're being too... I don't give a shit. It's a fact if you can't do... Stay away from armed rock, I don't care what happens. That's really what you said. If okay. you... Breaking into somebody inside house, someone's house your life. Yeah. to rob them. Yeah. Your life is forfeit. I think so. Right. What if they got kids there? You think I'm going to wait? You think I'm going to be patient? Never, bro. And that's what I'm saying, bro. This just, it's, the law is Kill crazy. Them. And this yeah. is another thing, bro. Nobody be thinking about, like, wanting to kill somebody. But, like, you got a youth. You got somebody. That, your mom or something. Maybe just, man, listen. We going, long story short. We gonna get this resolved. We'll figure this out. Everything else will come later. You feel me? I'm gonna make sure everybody in this month and in here is safe, and then all this other stuff. We'll figure that out later, bro. That's it, bro. That's not a rational way to think. That's not crazy of thinking. It's like, bro, we're in my house. Like we're in the house. We're not thinking about nobody coming up in here. We minding our business. You came in here and did X, Y, and Z and thought it was like what? Come on, son. Never. Especially if the youth here. Man, y'all need to... Your life I don't is for y'all. It's crazy. I don't give a shit. It's a whole ass rap. Yeah, you ain't got no sympathy It's a me. rap. They don't. Now, the legal situation, I think Preach brings up a great point, and that's, that's what a lot of law that's, says. That's, what's gonna have, that's the aftermath, though. Preach talking about this like, aftermath. It's very difficult to prove, so you're playing on dicey ground, which is unfortunate, because in a place where crime is starting to rise, not to the degree where it's like the apocalypse, but it's still going up fairly often. It just it sucks that it feels like the only people who have any tools to defend themselves are the people who shouldn't have the tools, meaning mm. uh, the criminals. We buy any car. Why sell your car at webuyanycar.com? Because selling it yourself means... So, you ask me what I think? Listen, police response out here is f***ing slow. By the time they get there, everything already f***ed up and you might be dead. So me, I would prefer to be able to do that and defend myself, but unfortunately, that's just not possible in this world. So, my thoughts on all this, I think it's unfortunate. I don't think the man should be charged with anything man was defending his mom for four people yeah. who attacked him yeah. and one four? jeez see look i didn't even know that yeah nah i ain't got too much to say i agree with them i i think my son should get off free that man free that innocent man uh i don't i don't know what people like i don't know what, what the law like maybe the law just needs certain certain laws need to change about stuff like that because i don't know what people expect bro yeah, I expect us, you expect something to happen somebody breaking the crib and then uh, us just we and hope that they don't kill us I hope they didn't violate, cause there's worse things than death as well. Like they could do, they could just run amok and do X, Y, and Z wild, egregious activities in here until y'all get here, or and afterwards, and then what? They out like, bro, nah, nah. Y'all be safe though, man. Y'all know your laws. You feel me? Uh, uh, know your gun safety laws. Be very versus as best as you can, man, and protect yourself. That's all I can say. I ain't gonna say too much else, man. Y'all, this is crazy.